Adani Ports is in advanced talks to acquire Gopalpur Ports in Odisha. In a significant move aligning with its strategic expansion plan, Adani Ports and Special Economic Zone, SCZ, are reportedly in advanced discussions with Shapurji Palanji Group to acquire Gopalpur Ports in Odisha. The proposed deal is estimated to be valued at approximately 1,100 crore rupees to 1,200 crore rupees in equity. Sources reveal that SP Ports Maintenance currently holds a majority stake of 56% in Gopalpur Ports, with the remaining ownership belonging to Odisha Stevadoras, or OSL. If successful, this acquisition would mark Adani Ports and SEZ's sixth venture into multi-purpose facilities along the eastern coast, in line with their String of Pearl strategy covering both eastern and western water margins. The due diligence process for the deal is currently underway. However, uncertainties persist regarding the finalization of the deal. Notably, JSW Infrastructure has also expressed interest in acquiring the same asset, with discussions centering on a 3,000 crore rupees enterprise valuation. The Mystery family, currently associated with the port, is reportedly dissatisfied with the proposed offering. The Gopalpur port's enterprise value is estimated to be around 5,000 crore rupees, with the mystery's equity valued at 2,000 crore rupees, as indicated in a company presentation reviewed by Financial Daily Reports. The port holds long-term bank facilities totaling 1,432 crore rupees as of February 2023, according to credit firm Care Edge. Shapurji Palanji Group had previously divested a 50% stake in the 5 million tons per annum PNP Maritime Services, or PNP Port, to JSW Infrastructure. The transaction, valued at 270 crore rupees in cash, had an enterprise value of 700 crore rupees. The funds generated from the sale are earmarked for repaying non-convertible debenture or NCD holders of a 14,300 crore rupees, rupee-denominated zero-coupon bond. Established in 2015, Gopalpur Ports strategically sits between the bustling Paradip Port and Vizag Port. Furthermore, it is seamlessly connected to the Golden Quadrilateral through NH516. As negotiations progress, industry watchers eagerly await the outcome of these talks that could reshape the maritime landscape along the eastern coast. Thank you for watching the Domain B channel. Please like, share, subscribe, and stay tuned for more business news. Also, read more business news and feature stories on domainb.com. The link is given in the description below.